Hey everyone, it's Michael here with GoodyReader.com. Amazon has just released a massive firmware update for a number of its e-readers. This includes the Kindle Voyage, the Kindle Paperwhite 2, the Paperwhite 3, and the touchscreen entry-level basic known as just the Kindle. So what's changed? Well, <laughs> they've modernized the home screen and it looks really great. Uh, first of all, Amazon really hasn't done anything new with the home screen for about three years, and it's time that the company refreshed it, and I'm really pleased with the way that it looks. Uh, first of all, it lists the books that you're currently reading, and it gives progression, so it lists how much of a percentage you have read the book. So, as you see from the screenshot, I'm 3% into the Steve Jobs book by Walter Isaacson, and you can see a number of other books that I have purchased from Amazon, but I haven't started yet. And you also see reading lists pop up here. Also, what's new is the Google-infused material design on the user interface. So they've minimized the way that the UI looks. So you have the Home button, Back, a Settings button, Goodreads and a store. Now in the past, the Goodreads logo was just a G and the store logo was just a shopping cart. But now Amazon has basically telling users what Goodreads is. So under the G, it says Goodreads and underneath the shopping cart, it now says store. And they've removed a number of UI features, including the light. Now, all you have to do is click on the gear between the back button and Goodreads, and it has a number of new options, including airplane mode, which disables the Wi-Fi, or if you have a 3G version, it disables that as well. There's also a sync button, so you can sync and you know anything that you've purchased from Amazon will be automatically synced to your device. And then this is also the submenu where you adjust the brightness of the front lit display. So if you have a paperweight or a voyage, you can actually configure the light and bright settings. There's also an all settings button there as well. So here are some other features. There is an open dyslexic reading font. So for people who suffer from you know, reading problems, there's a new font there for you. Uh, there's also new book recommendations. So you can choose your favorite genres of books and rape books you've already enjoyed to see a list of recommended titles. Also, when you're reading a book now, you can only share quotes and passages with Facebook, but Amazon is now allowing you to share quotes with Goodreads as well. In the description of this YouTube video, there's actually a link I'm going to include that goes over every single new feature featured on the Kindle, and this update is 5.7.2. So it's hitting e-readers right now via Wi-Fi, but if you just can't wait, there's also a link in the description that will take you to the page where you can actually download the firmware update, plug your e-reader into your PC via the USB cable, copy the bin file to just your root directory, and then just run the firm run uh, a firmware update and it'll automatically install it for you. So drop a comment below. Let us know what you think about this new uh, firmware update from Amazon. And if you're excited or not, for Goody Reader, my name's Michael.